Palpatine protection. Mm. Port, Spanish Town to Portmore, to Kingston, to the Caribbean, to love and hip hop, to conquering the entire globe on her birth certificate. It is Grace Hamilton, but we know her and love her as Queen, the Melon Goddess Spice. Everybody keep the applause going, please, for the beautiful black queens, the beautiful black queens, and the queen herself coming red hot. And to all the entertainers here tonight, thank you for your presence. To all the media houses, and as I said, I to ensure. Make some noise on the Queen's voice! The melanin goddess herself in the flesh and in her original black skin. She loves the skin that she's in. But of course, when she dropped the photograph on October 22, it was to capture your attention. And indeed, she discombobulated the internet and the world having us take a deeper look at ourselves and address the black hypocrisy that has been going on for years. If you rate Spice, are you rate the work? Are you rate the diva? Are you rate the goddess? Make some nice, come on. Absolutely amazing. And isn't she looking ravishing? Isn't she looking gorgeous? Can you make some noise, please? And we're gonna be having the press. Each member will be allowed one question. So please think about your question carefully. And we know that Spice is blessed with intelligence. And so she will be candid and answer your questions. Of course, we will ask that everything be done in a capsule of decency and everything with respect and love. But to the press, who are the persons just raise your hand and I will point at you, introduce yourself, say which media house you're from, and then you may ask Spice your question. But Spice, would you like to speak? Scan them! <laughs> you know, so that's not booking on Palestine. Nah, like, Queenie, oh my God. All right, let's start, please. Let's get our first question. Tingle. Need a microphone for Tingle? Absolutely amazing. Microphone. Coming, coming. Rastingle in the front here, please. Take all the photos you want. Go live. Hashtag black hypocrisy. No more of it. If you love the skin that you're in, make some noise. If you're black and proud, make some noise. If you love the skin that you're in, make some noise. And them something that we are talking about. Me got fluffy settings, spice got black people settings. And them things that we are talking about. The for them get hurt up and them cramp and paralyze. Take some panadol and lie down. You understand? Because we're here to stay and we're not going anywhere. Tingle your question. All right, so I'll do it. Sure, go ahead. What's your right, name and your media house? RVTV Satania, congrats on your Thank you so much. next step. Your title track number seven, it's at number seven, captured. Yes. Speaks to you breaking free. Would you like to elaborate for me? Most definitely. Um, the title track is called Captured. Um, that song is definitely dedicated to my record company, VP Records. And I dedicate it to them because I've signed a contract with VP Records for over 10 years now. And it was supposed to be five album deals. And up until this day, they've never released an album with me. So they are not allowing me to showcase my talents to my fans. They, they want an album. They can't get an album. I want to put out music. And that's how I feel. I feel captured. And so I wrote that song from my heart. Um, captured, you know, strictly directed to my record company. That's how I feel. I feel captured. All right. Thank you so very much. Next press uh, person. Media practitioner. Fuse from Zip 103 FM. Uh, with the entire stunt around the uh, song Black Hypocrisy, do you believe that the song or the message is lost or it's 
it captured the world, but would you remember it for the stunt or the message? I'd have to correct you using the word stunt. It was never a stunt. It was, um, it was a message, and it was done to raise awareness to colorism. I don't believe that it was lost. I mean, it will fly over some people's head. But the fact that I've received so many apologies from black women themselves who were calling me black and discriminating me because of this, my complexion that I'm in, I don't believe that it, it was lost. Because like I said, I mean, if you follow my page at Spice Official, I posted um, an apology from a young woman who in the past told me that, lads, and her, and her words were, I'm not telling her like, Spice look good, but you want dropping, I want to put some bleach. She could have grown up herself and look better. And I'm not telling her, and she continued to discrim discriminate me by my complexion. And um, when I read that apology, I cried, because little did she know that some of the words that she spoke, them semi black till me shine, till me look dirty, and it's the only line in life that will ever hurt me, because it never come from a Caucasian, trust me. This a black colorism, big hypocrisy. Those were words that she spoke. And so that video she made was over three years, and she remembered those lines. She remembered saying it. And she apologized for it and I never forget. And so I don't feel like the message was lost. I believe that a lot of people are definitely looking into themselves and they are definitely receiving the message that it doesn't matter what shade you are, we are all considered, one word, black. Amen. Thank you, Fuse. Next media house, please. Gentleman at the front here, sir. Your name and your media house. Steve James. Reggaeville United Reggae. Hello, sir. Um, New Star 93 Real Rock. Yeah, so back in the 80s, you know, music or reggae music. Women never bought it, so I wish Christian this is not asking about it as well. I'm a good old man, I'm a good old man, I'm a good old man, I'm a good old man. Music had a cause, right? Music had a cause. Yes. Yeah, Rastafari had a cause, Apartheid had a cause, right? No, you bring back that same cause of racism. Oh, you going? Oh, you going convert that to the youths them of today? Not just by the video. Oh, you going try to instill it in the youths, the artists, their mind, right? Oh, you going instill not only classism, well, classism and colorism. Oh, you going convert that? Not just love it, love what you're doing, but. Conversion. The question you asked, I noticed one word. In each of your sentences, you said, you. How are you going to do it? How are you going to do it? I can't do it. We, it should be the word. Because we have to do it. And we all have to do it together. So if you are a person who used to go on Instagram and discriminate another black sister or discriminate something that she's doing, that's what you need to stop. So we all have to do it together. And since that question, and I'm using the word we, let me start by saying colorism starts from within the home. So you have even mothers that is doing it. She has two child, two separate father. She call one bad ear and one good ear. And she used the one word. Lord, you're black like your papa. You're black like your father. We need to stop that. You go to school and a child have real Negro hair. Picky, picky, head girl. We need to stop that. So I, to answer your question, I can't do it by myself. We all have to do it together. Good job. We all have to do it together to advance the welfare of the whole human race. Next question, next media house, please. BOJTV, go ahead, sir. Right, suspense. He asked me to ask. He He said, could you ask it on behalf of BOJTV? So it's not Ari this time, all right? <laughs> he wants to know, so Rampin Shop Drop? 2009. Yes, that was quite amazing. I mean, collabing with Cartel. Mm -hmm. No, Black Hypocrisy, on your own, not a collab, did you think you would have had such a reach? I, I paraphrased it for him. <laughs> the question is a bit confusing. I'm not sure what, what the question has to do with Rampin' Shop or... I'm, I'm, I'm well, not sure. Well, I think sure. he's Can saying you... when Rampin' Shop came out, right? It was, she did it went viral. Video. It was a big hit. Okay, but that's that what you're trying to say. that was cartel. Okay. But now on your own, did right. you expect the same? You know what? When I dropped the picture, I wanted to capture just Jamaica because... The colorism, what I'm attacking, you know, is what I know about. I don't know what... We are not the only black um, race. There's other races that is experiencing the same thing.
but I can't speak out for them. I have to speak out for what I know. So when I dropped the picture, first I thought that it would just mingle up in a Jamaica and that we would talk among ourselves and then I'll grab everybody's attention, you know, to display my message. But little did I know that it would grab the world yes. attention. And so to be honest, I really never expect what happened. <laughs> I really never expected to go. Effect. Exactly. <laughs> I never expect it at all. So, listen did I know that it would have been so huge. Next to Media House, please. Thank you. Did she answer your question, sir? BOJ TV, are you satisfied? Good job. Next to Media House, please, you could just raise Some your hand. Some the fans, them not ask nothing. Yeah, I'm going to open it up to the fans. Okay, okay. The fans who have a question. That's them, my comfy, my you people, them, my fans, them. Yeah. 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 So, yes, sir, go ahead, please. Spice. Um, this is, I'm Charles Hyatt from Good News Jamaica. Hi, Charles. Hi. Uh, so you've been a trendsetter for many, many, many years. Is this a rebranding of Spice to Hello. start to talk about social commentary as far as uh, picking up uh, just empowerment and all those type of things? With You've started with the Grace Hamilton uh, Foundation. Now you've dropped this very, very important topic on social commentary. Is it a new um, branding of Spice? You know what, I wouldn't say it's a new branding because I don't want you to feel that I'm going to stay there and continue singing reggae song. I'm going to keep on singing my local slack song them, to be honest, because that's what the people love me for. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's what the people and my fans love me for. So I wouldn't say rebranding. But I must say that there's a growth in everything and I'm able to attack different you know eras and so that was just one of them a lot of times people say oh spice always singing this type of song or that type of song but the truth is that's what my fans love me for and that's what keeps me traveling and that's what keeps my fan base growing but if there comes a time thank you but there comes a time if i see something that needs to be addressed you know i need to address it and this is something that was really needed it's been swept under the rug and i as a black woman myself i just felt the need to attack it at this time the multifaceted spice. And of course, the men up here. Wow. <laughs> Black people in hypocrisy. I'm looking. They could have tricked me. They said, I can't kneel back. Spice, hold off of Vanessa now. Drop a song. Hold off, hold off of Vanessa. We're sparking it. Look how she wants to drop a song. Right in the big of the people, them question. Come on, them, buddy. Call me. We're sparking it. and I sat in my chair and I was trying to behave myself and Miss Kitty was the one that's what I like I didn't do anything like she do it I just love the black men right here can I uh, can I appreciate my kings can I ladies if the man them body would bust on Miss Kitty black now come back queen sit down sit down queen. I can yes. sit down yes queen amen all right, and the fans who would like to ask a question, yeah, man, include the fans then. Come up to the front and get the microphone just to or raise bring your the hand. mic to them. Or we'll bring the mic to you as well. Cara is here, looking so fucking and beautiful. Hey, Cara, how you doing, girl? The most beautiful right hand anyone can Hello. have. Hello, so let Cara me Wilson. So all the fans who would like to ask a question, and if there are any artists here, I see Pampute. I see a number of persons here. If you have questions, you too can Pampute come to the front. is here. Bring up my black sister. Yep. Yes. Am I a real sister that for life? Fluff it to the world. Yes. Pressure the skinny girl. And... <laughs> Sorry, did I say that? Yeah. Fans, the fans, where are the fans? I need a fan question. Is this a fan? Right here, oh, a fan is right here. Cara? Pampute is here. A Pampute is here. Make some noise of Pampute. Give it up to Pampute. Fan question. No, but she's not fluffy again. We are fluffy spice. So, so we're doing that. 
fan? You are a fan? Oh, you take the same way. No, I'm not taking my shoes, but I'm taking me for the same way. Okay, I'm going. <laughs> yeah. Ma. <laughs> Thanks so much, I'm to everybody. And that is what supporting is all about. And guys, listen. As people of the Negroid race, it is important that we support each other. It is time we stop the division and stop the old slave versus field slave mentality and unite because divided we are going to fall. We have to come together and that is what a lot of races have over us. They bond together, they bind together, they support each other and if we are to succeed, we have to do the same. All right, young lady who is a fan, say your name please. Um, my name is Sarah Philly, and I am from Toronto. Hi, Sarah. You're flying. Hi. I am a big fan of you. Thank you so much for being a fan. I appreciate no that. No problem. Sorry, I'm recording at the same time. I wanted to know, um, I am a Love & Hip Hop fan. I wanted to know if you experienced any colorism issues with the crew and cast of Love & Hip Hop. Have you ever experienced that as a new Jamaican onto the show? You know what? I'm not going to lie. Thank the cast you. The cast members from Love and Hip Hop, they are really genuine in lies. They like me. They want me to teach them look at Jamaican something. They want me to carry them go eat Akian saltfish. They love our culture. And so I wouldn't say I've experienced any form of colorism from any of the cast members within Love and Hip Hop um, Atlanta franchise. They're all very nice. Thank Except you. for... <laughs> ja, ja, team. Ja, no. <laughs> Boy, when we see all that girl, you know, let's say what I should know it. She know it. We want to call the phone. We want to call the phone and take away our passport. Kitty, you have any more fan questions? Fan questions? Who's here? Okay, here's a fan over here. A male fan. Call me Perry the mic. Do not give the mic to Perry. But he's a Cara, Cara, please do not. Okay. Do not bring the mic to Perry. Are we going to give Perry my boy Trevor? Perry's not a fan. He's a stalker. Every day I'm the phone. phone. Every day in the phone, that's not a fan, he's a stalker. Oh my god, call the police. Is there, are there any police Here here? question. <laughs> okay, bad boy Trevor, go ahead, up, please. Up. Spice, I want to say congratulations on the song that you have. Thank you so we much. My side of the world, love it. My side of the world? What's your side of the world? What's your side of the world? Unleash. Unleash what? Sorry, they understand. Oh, 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 the slave masters used to have the slaves. And I like what they said about we. Because when slaves used to talk to a broken master, when they say, we sick boss? If boss sick, is we sick. If boss hungry, we hungry. So right now, Spice, we black, we black. So broken master say, black slave go do this. Boss sick, go do that. Boss hungry, we hungry. No, Spice, just like you say, we black. Thank you. Thank you, Trevor. I don't know what's Trevor's side. And me normally either. Trevor get discriminated for another reason, but that is our next time. We don't know what we're going for Trevor. Ooh, seems to be a shot. But thank you so very much, bad boy Trevor. Uh, do we have a... I need a question from a male fan. Do we have a male... Perry. Sir, the white shirt. So now I'm going to keep on my Perry side. Oh, no, I mean, he's going to come in a little bit. Sir, in the white shirt, step forward, please. My nice oh, clean Jerry. And I want to take a question. Like this. Shaq, him call me and tell me to look mix up them while I want to Jamaica. I also want to take a question. I want to ask a question from social media as well, because I know her fans are there. Sir, go ahead, please. What's your name? Um, My name is Akim, but I'm a younger artist. My name, my artist name is Platinum. Speaking to my younger artist, Perfection, um, do you plan on starting your own record label? Since what you have been through, you don't want a young artist like me to go through it. So, you plan on starting your own record label? I already started my own record label. The name of it is Spice Official Entertainment. And, and what are the um? Tanika is here. Where's Tanika? Where's it's Tanika? Tanika is here. One of the first young artists that I'm trying to push out to the world. So I already started my record label, and All this right. is it's Tanika, and she's here. She's also here with me. 
Spice Official Entertainment is the name of it. And speaking of that, my record label is the producer for 80% of the songs on Captured Mixtape. I produced them myself. Wow, round of applause. And by the way, this Spice, is Tanika. May I also ask, because we don't just want to... We're gonna fly in. Like, you know, we don't just want to hear about um, Captured. We want to buy Captured. Where yes. can we get it to purchase now? Spice Official is my name. And all you have to do is click the link in my bio. And it leads you to all platform, anywhere you whether you have iPhone, Android. Just click the link in my bio, Spice Official. Everybody, it's available on all platforms, all digital outlets. Well, everybody tonight, I'm charging all of us to go on our phones and start the support from here. Let's all make Captured Go platinum, make it sell. So till Shafi has, hello, Shafi, support, support the, music. the music the right way. Don't just download it and get it free and bootleg it. Let us, let us buy it. The same who buy the rapper them own, Jay Z them own, all of them own. Let us support Spice. Have to so, send them off on YouTube. Yeah, and that's support too. the music the right way. Amen. And speaking of that, I also want to elaborate because they might talk about that, but they talk about this. Remember them say me black, I'm a this, I'm a that, I'm a ask that, I'm a comfort. Please note that Captured took Bob Marley off of the number one spot. We don't need to talk about that. Oh, wow. I said so nice. Bob Marley. Because I didn't know that Bob Marley was in the number one spot until I see Captured go there. I'm going to go for make a screenshot. I'm going to say Bob Marley, they are number two. So I'm going to say, me, little Gracie, me. So, more of the people them for know so they can talk about that. And say, Spice. what is all this? What? See it here? Two of the album. See it here. She calls me, she asks me if I buy an album. I said, I buy one for me and one for somebody in here. Who wants the album? Yeah. No, because I can't buy the album from Jamaica. So, I support that. See money, yeah? US dollar, say one. See it here? See it here. I asked her if she buy the album. She said, Jamaica now have iTunes, you cannot buy the album from you, so she come with our money. We collect and that come with our US. Tamika, have our album so. collecting. Tamika, you have your calculator. <laughs> you have everything. You're ready. Good. It's well, for $9, so I owe you $2 if you want to. Nine and nine eighteen. So more $2 US. We'll keep no it. problem. We'll take the man there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Take thank you, Sparky, baby. All thank right, you. thank you, Sparky. Yes, Perry, I have a question. Perry. All right, so, um, a lot of people don't know this side of Spice, Grace Hamilton. Um, she's very self-aware and of course she's very self-conscious of what's happening around the world. Now you did a song entitled Black Hypocrisy and back in the day you also did a song called Dear Honorable. Now my question to you is, are there any other social issues that you feel passionate about that you might want to pursue in song? Um, there's so much. Should I start listing them or should I keep them a secret? Because well, if an artist, they have no one but if my idea and I don't. <laughs> we also know you're all for woman empowerment. <laughs> yeah, I'm all for woman empowerment. There's so many other issues. But one thing I, th I think I really want to sing about is the current thing that's happening in Jamaica right now. And I think when I'm overseas, I get a call every three days as somebody died or you know we're losing people that we love too much and the crime is going up and i think my next song is going to be spice of prime minister yeah. you heard it here first so and i'm going to attack all the issues that's happening within my country i think that's going to be my next song spice of prime so minister going to, yes make some noise yeah. we're going to take three more questions one from a fan and two from uh, media practitioners good evening ma'am how are you I want to perform for the people they must start going that's coming right up they're not busy if the media they are not me yes ma'am go ahead with your question please i back in at the chair i'm sorry i'm so sorry thank you yes ma'am go ahead with your question please uh, my name is zinia yes and i'm a really big fan of these spices thank you so Can much I please take a picture with you <laughs> Sure you can. Sure you Letter can. Let please, security. The girl wants a picture. Make sure come. I know Letter what it means please. to travel from so far and you just want a picture. Tall well, man, carry this young lady in for me, please. One second, please. One more question. Or just, let me, let me just want ask this male. Want let me just ask this so. male. All right, here the question. Go ahead, right, sir. So, um, Hello, good night. I'm Roshan. Roshan. Hi, 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 um, a lot of people are saying that they notice that other female artists who are lighter skin are getting a lot 
more support in you're corporate not Jamaica. Doing no, a wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did you experience any sort of discrimination, do you believe, based on color in corporate Jamaica? If I experience any form? Ye yes, tell the truth, come on. Do you think that if you were lighter, you would be more, have more corporate sponsors? You know, that Perry has set me up. <laughs> you know what? Um, will you meet at the truth? You know. <laughs> well, you have Speroni. Yeah, have to big up Speroni. Yeah. Shout out to Speroni. Um, I've been in the business for over a decade. Speroni is the only um, corporate that, you know, worked with me. And that's why I was pushing their brand so extremely hard. Um... Do I believe if I was lighter, I would get more corporate sponsor? Yes, I believe so. Amen. Um, do I believe I would get more support from corporate world? Yes, I believe so. Um, I don't want to elaborate too much. And I see them saying, talk the truth, Ray, Ray, Ray. But like I said, colorism do exist in Jamaica. And I feel like if I was a lighter skin, then I would be... More marketable. Yeah, but, uh, yeah. All right. Well, we're keeping it real, but of course, being diplomatic at the same time, not a problem. One more question, please, media young lady. Hello, good night, twice. Sharita Brazil from the Star. Yes. Um, so Sharika, Lord was... Jesus, everything at me, you call me. Yes, <laughs> Sharika. Yes, Are you in Sharika? Good girl. <laughs> everything at me, you call me. Okay. So, um, when the song dropped, of course, it shook up the entire world. Um, but there are persons out there, I know I've personally heard the feedback, um, so the mixtape is there, Black Hypocrisy is on the mixtape. Do you think there is a disconnect between the other songs that, that's on the, mix, the mixtape and Black Hypocrisy since it was sending a positive message and the other songs, you know, you're back to your broke out, broke out? No, I don't think there's any disconnection because like I said, my fans know me for being me and Spice and giving them the Slack songs. They already know Genie. I go out and I perform Genie and they're already singing Genie. They already know um, most of the songs. Cool it. Them, cool it, cool it down. Cool it, cool it down. They already know other songs. So, I mean, that was just an opener. Every album have a titled song and I think that was just the titled song. And they're going to take time out to, to know the rest of the songs because that what they know Spice for. So I don't think there's going to be any disconnect between the other songs. And like I said, the mixtape itself already hit number one. So they are purchasing. Thank you, Smurf Gang! Smurfette, thank you very much. Thank you so very much. Uh, yes, baby, come picture. Where, where are you from? Chicago. The Windy City. Go ahead, baby. Middle for the... So everybody, I don't want one picture too. She don't want to leave her vision. Kevin, make yourself useful. Nobody drop the door, wait, watch your side. We don't have the insurance. We don't have ever sink in my belly. Yeah, I'm great. Thank you. Thank you. Nice meeting you. And thanks for coming. Hope you're having fun. You're having fun in Jamaica. You enjoy the place? Yes. You're going to look at Jamaica, my friend? All right, all right. She find a marriage. She know what time it is. You see, her locks catch up good. But guys, <laughs> guys, I want you to make some noise for Queen Spice. I'm me to tell you, Manala, I try you. But I would just like to also say that when I saw the picture, I saw the title of the song, I saw the title of the mixtape, you captured all of us. And I have mad love and respect for what you have done. And a part of being an entertainer is touching those topics that other people are sometimes afraid to address. There are many people who are suffering in silence and what you have done is shed some light on it and you have given them a voice. And the voice is not just to wind up, but it's also to bring consciousness and awareness to issues that are affecting even the babies, even children. Children are growing up with low self-esteem, feeling like they're not good enough because of black hypocrisy. And I do hope that there are many people the conversation has started and I want to give you kudos for being brave enough to talk about it, to address it, and to sing about it in the very innovative and ingenious way that you have. I wish you continued success. I hope that you will continue to strive and thrive in as many ways as possible. And when the people them call you for white chicks too, you just call me as well. Yes. <laughs> yeah, your sister. Come remember, say, well, got Hollywood, go shell it down. But congratulations Thank on your you success. So much. And all the best. Make some noise for Spice, the Melanin Brothers. Thank you so much. Thank you. What? The fire on the falls. And the fire meeting on the fire. The people that fall.
girls here on fire, careful. Thank you, ladies. So what? I'm not ready for perform yet. Okay, hold on there, hold on there. So let oh, go and come back. No, the good body man, them come off. And then, and then okay. let me go to my intro. Right, okay. Yeah. Thank you, ladies. A performance sound. Are you ready for go on? No. You ready for go on? No. Who ready for party or no? This a the style, yes a this a the style. Pelpa time, me a tell you. This a the style. Hear me now? It's all about pelpa time. Keep it locked. Spice it up. Mm hmm. The boy a catch me pan the corner pan me head All he must send it me a ball me out for dead The boy a beat he like a hammer pan the lead New way bone me tear the sheet up on the bed Under fire me wool under fire One vice I done vice I don't represent you know You don't know the damn thing going on man Pelpa time you know Fourth generation you know You laugh in a talk Yes the damn thing I guess so Hot tool hot 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 Pelpa time Room 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 Go pronouns Crazy, I'm crazy, I'm crazy. You niggas know that I'm crazy. 545, not she 80. Full of gun shit, them 280. The 32 too long, the clip that 280. The 17 better precise and me hear me.